Yo, what's up? I am back with another Roblox Studio tutorial, and in this video, I will be showing you how to make a decal slideshow GUI where every couple seconds it switches between all the different images that you want to show. Alright, so in Starter GUI, I have a screen GUI, and in here, I'm going to add an image label, which is where the picture is going to display. I'm going to move it into the center of the screen change the size a little bit and also you're going to want to add a local script and inside this local script we are going to make a variable to the image label like that and then after we're going to make a list to hold all the different image links that we want to show so I'm going to make a variable called images set that to a table and inside here you're going to want to put in the links to the images that you want to show Alright, so if you don't know how to add images to your game, you go up to the top, click open your asset manager, and click this button that says bulk import, and then it opens up your file explorer where you can select the images that you want to upload. So inside the asset manager, if you open the images folder, you'll see the images that you have uploaded to your game. Now in order to get the link for the images, we, you, you just have to right click on the image that you want, and select copy ID to clipboard and inside here put in the set of double quotes and inside here just copy and paste the link inside there and it's already formatted with the RBX asset ID prefix alright so just copy and paste the links for every single one of the images that you want to add I only have two for demonstration after you've done that you can make the logic first make an infinite while loop by writing while true do then make a for loop that looks like this. So what it's doing is it'll loop over every single item inside this images list and it'll store that inside the variable i. And what we can do is we can just set the image labels image equal to i and it'll just cycle between these two links that I have in my table here. And uh, we want to uh, give it some time between each image switch. So we can just wait for like two seconds. You can change this to however long you want to wait between image switches. So now let's test it. All right, so you can see my picture here and you can see it's switching between the two, two pictures that I have specified inside the table. All right, so that is it for this video. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.